I live in an HOA with limitations on permanent antennas, so I had to come up with a way to get temporary antennas up in order to operate. I love working on antennas. In this video, we'll describe my tilt-up system. A 17-foot tall MFJ fiberglass mast is hinged at the bottom with a simple U-bracket of steel embedded in a small amount of concrete. A one-quarter inch bolt forms the hinge pin. Here I am Tilting up my antenna after first making sure it isn't frozen to the ground, as it is winter here in eastern Washington state. I simply walk it up and then hold it up with the 400 pound test paracord free guy that you see me holding. There are two fixed guy ropes that are secured with screw and anchors in the ground and I had those adjusted to the correct lengths with just a bare mass with no rotator or mass first. Getting the fixed guy lines to the right length so that the mass is perpendicular to the ground can be a challenge, but look up adjustable knots on YouTube and you can find easy ways to change the fixed guy line lengths. The free guy rope that I use to hold the mast up while I walk to the attach point has a dog hook at the end so I can clip it and unclip it quickly. When you are ready to tilt the mast back down, Unhook the free guy and keep the mast vertical with the rope until you walk up to it, and then walk it back down by hand. Don't try to use the rope to let it down, as it will get away from you as the leverage increases rapidly as it nears the ground. The guy ropes are held to the mast with a triangular piece of plastic kitchen cutting board. The triangular piece is secured from the bottom with an electrical conduit mounting bracket you can find at Lowe's Hardware. The secret to this tilt-up mast is that the fixed guys are aligning and stabilizing the mast when those fixed guys become tight. I use Bolin knots at the triangular plate and adjustable knots at all the ground attach points. The RCA antenna rotator you see in this photo is a neat unit, but make sure you do not mount any antennas more than a few feet above it as the leverage will damage it. The rotator will last a long time if antennas are mounted close to the rotator. Don't try this project if you have any electrical wires around or if you cannot control the challenges and dangers with tall or heavy objects and hazards from ropes. I never expected to be working DX from my home QTH and this tilt-up mass system has been a game changer for me. 73's!